about just getting out there first day of practice? Uh, yeah, getting out there for the first day of practice was like um, something we was waiting on for a long time. I know other teams started before us, but you know uh, we just had to get stronger in the weight room. And, it was pretty fun. After the season you guys had last year, how hard was it to wait and kind of sit and wait till you could get back out there again and kind of get that taste out of your mouth? Well, uh, it was very hard for us. Uh, you know, after we had a bad season, you know, a few players uh, wanting that opportunity to get back, get back to that 2010 season. You know, but it, it was very bad. Uh, but we just, you know, worked out and worked out. You know, trying to get that edge back. Any possibility of you maybe moving over and do some things on offense? It will. It, it will be a possibility. Uh, I spoke with Coach Miles on, and it seems like a plan. I mean, I won't mind at all. Playing, playing O's position. Yeah. Are you as fast as out there? <laughs> In my opinion, yeah. You guys Probably faster. A, you guys ever in a foot race one on one? We never did, but I believe I could beat him. Probably by a foot. By a foot. <laughs> as tough as things were for you last year, did you ever say, did you ever consider just moving on? Uh, nah. nah. Let's keep it straightforward. So right now, do you feel like you're your defensive back right now? Kind of yeah. Like? I feel like I'm defensive back. Uh, fine towards that position. Mm. I would say I'm part-time, you know, offense. Kind of like Deion Sanders, you know. Yeah. Anything <laughs> <laughs> else? Florida. Rob, how about the, are you, you think you're going to end up being a corner? I believe I'm going to be, uh, I'm going to end up being a cornerback. Boundary cornerback. Yeah. Because I'm, I'm a type of guy, uh, stop the run first. You know, I, I, uh, last spring I, I've improved of my, uh, with my cover skills. And, uh, and uh, the boundary corner is my position and it fits my, 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 what type of player I am. Coach Johnson said the boundary corner really might have to be even more, more physical than the, than the star position. Is that, is that what you like about it, a chance to, to, to play physical like that? Yeah, that's what I like about it. I feel like physical is my middle name. How does Coach Smith compare to working with Coach Martinez last year? Just the difference in uh, Coach Smith is more is more forward. Uh, he's a straightforward guy. He'll tell you what he don't like and do like. And he's more of like an attitude guy, you know. So he, he's very cool, and I can learn a lot from him. So he can be a funny guy. He can say some funny things, he can. funny sayings. What, what have you heard from him so far that's really stuck with you? Yeah, the type of guy he is that, that makes us laugh, you know. Uh, when we do have uh, some assignments to do, like let's say blitz, he'll be like, hit him in the head, you know. So he, he, he's a very funny guy. He's a lot, he's a lot like aggressive, like the way he screams at us and all that stuff. I mean, I'm surprised for a 50 year old man, he can still do all those things. For all the DBs collectively, I mean, is there a chip on your shoulder after, uh, obviously, Harvison said be more opportunistic this season than you were a year ago? Is there a chip on your shoulder to prove that you guys can't can do that? Yeah, it is. I mean, I see it uh, in the film room and out there. Uh, there's, there's a lot of changes going on, and I feel like every, everyone is, like, different, and everyone has a chip on their shoulder to get better. Yeah. Right. Practice. Appreciate it. Thank you, bro. It was. Uh, you know, it was pretty much fast paced, but we still uh, on the on urge of learning and trying to get that fast pace going more faster than today. But yeah, it's just pretty much, you know, trying to get our edge back.